So I finally figured out the timing problem when playing the drums with Windows 10. It always felt slightly off and I wasn't sure is it because I'm a noob and just my timing is off, but it always felt like it's just a little bit off. The main thing is to fix this is we need to use Roland's driver and the documentation says put it into vendor mode. I couldn't figure out what are they talking about. Then I found um, instructions for some other instruments that gave me a hint on what that is. So this is what it is. So you have to come to your click setup and here you have USB. Click enter there and this is what they're talking about. Change this to vendor mode. By default it is generic um, and you want to keep that at vendor and to change this you have to switch it off and on. So let that happen. Okay, I'm gonna turn it back on. Right now, of course, it's gone back to generic. I'm gonna switch it to Windows. So let's set it to the right mode. Come to USB, enter, and set it to vendor. And turn it off. And when you do that, and I have the cable connected to a Windows 10 machine, I think cable is the, gives the best performance. So we will just go with the cable. Now I'm going to verify if it is in vendor mode and Windows will automatically download the correct roll and drivers and set it up. And I will show that too. So here we are. Enter, it is in vendor mode. And if you go check on Windows, let's look at devices here. Uh, device manager. There is TD17. And if you look at the driver, it says roll it. Once that is done, this is, we can, uh, then I run, you're able to set the buffer sizes. And I have set it for minimum. Although it says, as you change this, it says stability increases. We can see stability is just one oh, and real time is increasing. If I move that up, look how real time decreases and stability increases. I have not had any stability issues, so I, I have kept it at one. But even at two, three, it all feels real time. So that's just, I'm gonna use two for this time. Okay, so now that we have that, if you go into this drumming software setup, pick the ASIO compatible driver, uh, but MIDI in and all this is set up. Now when I drum, the timing should be good. fixed so that's your solution just put the roll and inventor mode It'll, windows 10 will automatically pick up the drivers and if it's still not real time go to the app that will show up the td17 app you can adjust the you can adjust the configuration on it i'll pull that up again You can adjust this if, but just switching to this and moving away from the Windows driver, I felt like the timing were perfect. That's all. Bye.